Hi, welcome to Lessons with John. Uh, today we're going to try Coming Home Baby. Alright, we got a G minor 7. And that's it. Alright, that's one way to play it. Alright, what, what we got is G minor 7 for four bars. C minor 7 for two. Back to G minor 7 for two. B flat 7 for a measure and then A7, A flat 7, back to G minor 7 for two bars. So G minor 7, you bar the top two strings at the 1st fret, 3rd string, 2nd uh, fret, open for a uh, 4th string. Okay, that's my G minor 7. Okay, and all I'm doing for this strum is like down, down. So two of those get one measure. So you do uh, four measures of the G minor 7. So here it is. Two more times. Like that. Then the C minor 7, just bar the whole 3rd fret. Just uh, two measures of that one. Then back to the G minor 7 for two. Then you need a B flat 7. Uh, so what you're going to do there is 4th string, 3rd fret, 3rd string, 5th fret, 2nd string, 4th fret, and 1st string, 5th fret. That's my B flat 7. I'm going to play that for four beats. So it's like one, two, three, four, and then move it back to the second fret for two beats, first fret for two beats, and that's it. So that's a B flat seven to an A seven to an A flat seven, back to G minor seven for two. Two measures, that is. All right. So uh, if you didn't catch on to that, I went over the B flat seven. The A seven is the fourth string second fret, the third string fourth fret the second string third fret and the first string fourth fret. That's my A7. Then the A flat seven is the fourth string first fret, third string third fret, second string second fret, first string third fret. That's an A flat seven. And then back to the G minor seven. Okay? So uh, that, this is based on the Mel Torme version of the song. Uh, he's got the backup singer singing the melody uh, while he's um, singing his own thing. Um, a uh, really cool version. Um, some people play, instead of a C minor 7, uh, the way it was written, the song, there was an E flat 9 instead. So let's try that. E flat 9, you would bar uh, the the third, second, and first string at the first fret and open fourth string. That would be your E flat 9, and let's try it like that. So I'm just going to substitute that chord for the C minor 7. You might like it better. So G minor 7. E flat 9. Back to the G minor 7. It's actually easier. And then the B flat 7, and then the A7 to the A flat 7 to the G minor 7. Okay, and it just keeps cycling around that pattern. It's kind of like a, it's a minor blues so uh, pattern, uh, blues progression. So, any questions, comments down below? Uh, play more OOP. Please subscribe, and thanks for watching.